So the first thing I'm doing is priming my skin using the Bare Minerals Prime Time. This one's a neutralizing shade as per usual um, and it is my favorite primer of the moment. Then for my foundation I'm using the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Stick Foundation. I still don't love this to be quite honest guys. Um, if you want to see a in-depth review and like a demo please let me know but um, I'm just not a huge fan. I like it but yeah it's not my favorite but I'm just blending all of it in using a damp beauty blender and then I went in and applied some more to the center of my face just because I didn't have enough coverage to prime my lids I'm just using MAC painterly paint pot just on my finger and then I'm using the Urban Decay Vice 4 palette again and I'm taking this bony brown sort of shade and I'm just buffing this all over the lid and into the crease I'm um, just being quite messy with it. I just want to use this as a transition shade. Then I'm taking this warm toned brown shade and just using the same blending brush and just starting to buff this in the outer corner. Um, and I am being quite messy. I didn't really want this look to be perfect. I just wanted it to be nice and blown out and smoky. Then I'm taking this sparkly black shade and just on a MAC 217 brush, it's a little bit more precise. I'm just building this up in the outer V. And then for the lid shade, I'm taking this beautiful orangey gold shade. I started to apply it and it wasn't quite pigmented enough, so I did take Fix Plus on my brush and then just started to pack the color on. It is absolutely gorgeous. I'll have all these shade names listed down below because I don't know them off by heart. And then I'm just going in with my blending brush once again and making sure everything is nice and seamless. Then just using a black liner, this one is just the Eye of Horus Black Coal Pencil. I'm just tight lining and lining my upper lash line just quite lightly just to give it a little bit more depth. Um, and then I took a flat little definer brush and just smudged out that eyeliner on the top lash line just so everything was nice and smoky. Then I gave my lashes a curl and just applied some mascara. This is the MAC in Extreme Dimension 3D Black Lash. And for falsies, I'm using my favourites. These are the Vegas Nay and I Lua Shining Star Lashes. Then back onto the face, I'm just concealing my under eyes and the centre of my face using Pro Long Wear Concealer. This one's in the shade NC20. So just using my Beauty Blender again just to apply this all down the centres of my the centres, the centre of my face. Um, just to conceal and to highlight these areas. Then to set the concealer, I'm using MAC MSF Natural in the shade Light Plus and I'm just using a Morphe G6 brush um, and just pressing the powder into my skin. And then I am taking the powder just where I'm going to contour, um, just so that my powder contour goes on the top like nice and smoothly and doesn't get stuck to the liquid products. Um, so I'm just using the Mineralized Skin Finish in Dark Deepest um, just to contour and bronze up my skin. And then to add some colour to my cheeks, I'm using Milani Luminoso blush. I absolutely love this. I'm just applying it to my cheeks and blending it back. And then to highlight, I'm using Becca and Jaclyn Hill's Champagne Pop highlighter just on my Real Techniques setting brush. I love this brush for highlighting. It's honestly my favourite thing ever. So I'm just applying this to the centre of my face and all the high points. And then I'm going to set everything in place using Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Then moving on to the lower lash line, I wanted to do a pop of colour, so I'm first taking this bright green shade on a smudger brush and I'm just applying this right onto the lash line and bringing it right into the inner corner. So just really smudging that into the lash line and adding the colour and then I go ahead and take a clean blending brush and I'm just blending the shade out. 
Then I took this sort of light greeny silvery shade and I applied this into the inner corner of my eye. Um, but I did decide I wanted a little bit more of a neutral colour so I just applied MAC Nylon over the top. Then I just coated my lashes, my lower lash in mascara and moved on to the lips so I decided to go a bold lip as well. This is the Colourpop Ultra Satin Lip in the shade Cozy. Um, so after the lip colour is on, the look is complete. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you in my next video.